Welcome to Seven Trumpets Prep. And guys, welcome to another edition of Off-Grid Contracting. Now today, I'm here at Randy's new shop, and I can't wait to show you the things that he's got going on. He's done so much since the last time we got to visit, which was, what, six months ago? Oh, we yeah. Yeah, at least. Man, it's least. great to see you again. Hey, thanks. Thanks for coming back and visiting. Absolutely. So, uh, t tell the guys kind of what you got going on. Your website's awesome looking now. Got oh, yeah. Call. We're, uh, you know, you can't sit still when you got people really liking what you do. And, um, and with me, I, I, I'm not satisfied with just doing one thing or doing it halfway. You just got to keep digging in. Um, yeah, we were out in the middle of a field building the Hobbit House. And when we built American Freedom, the first one on Memorial Day, um, we launched it on tiny house listings. And um, wow, I got bombarded. And uh, so five months from then, we built 10 homes in five months. So our build rate is about 14, 12 to 14 days we can build a house. Out the door. It was just two of us, now there's three of us. Um, we got it down pretty good, and now we're even going to be more efficient. We were outside. We built an old lean to the building underneath to keep from getting wet. And then uh, after our 10th home, we said, man, I got to have something else. So I was looking around in the area, we found this awesome factory. It's an old factory, been here for years. Uh, your father used to work here, yeah. you know, so that's kind of cool. And um, they allowed us to come in here, and we got a great rent. Um, We'll show you our wood stove we got in here, and we got a forklift that we can bring our stuff in. It's just, we're rocketing up. And what I want to do, I want to make tiny, incredible tiny homes the household name for tiny homes. That's a big feat because there are some awesome people out here. And I'm not competing against these people. I mean, everybody's doing some beautiful, beautiful work. And I'm finding that um, what we want to do is do the really, really nice work in affordable homes. I mean, a really affordable price. As you can see on our website, incrediblytinyhomes.com, uh, you know, a lot of your homes look at their 60, 70, 80,000. We'll do that same home for 25, 30. Same home, same materials, everything. The only thing that we turn on a little bit different is we don't spend the money on the high-end windows. I'll go on all vinyl windows. Now, if you want to crank out window that's three or four hundred dollars with vinyl clad wood, we'll do that. And some of the high-end appliances. But if we'll throw in a high-end appliance package and some windows, you may be looking at another six, seven thousand. We're still half of what the competition wants, you know. And then we'll produce them. We'll still be out under 14-day build time, and that's kind of our. We'll see how it goes, you know. So far, it's been working. Um, we're in an indoor facility. Everything's everything's conditioned now. Rain, sleet, shine, snow. Man, we're like the mail. We'll get it there, you know. <laughs> right. Yeah. And uh, we're excited, you know, I got, I got, we've got wood, I've uh, accumulated tons of reclaimed lumber. I mean, I've got probably, if you put it all together, it's the size of half of a football field of lumber. And it's coming. And the place here is allowing us to stage it all. That's what keeps our costs down low, because I'm able to produce, you know, beautiful homes, nice lumber. Some of it's just been um, overstocked. Some of it's been maybe not taken care of as well. We'll cut that part out. We gotta, we gotta work on it a little bit because you just can't grab the board and nail it up. Right. But our finding out and our customers are liking it. You know, we're, we're using things that normally nobody would use. But they're high end, they're really nice. Some of this wood comes from Australia, New Zealand, Europe. It comes from all over the world and it's not being used anymore like it was overstock or something, you know. So we're excited about what we can do. I've got the manpower, we've got the materials, We've got the facility, and Lord knows I got the want. So let's see what happens. You know, we got a beautiful website. Um, I've got now a marketing person that's coming in and helping me do all my social media and marketing. And um, yeah, I made it a pretty nice guy. He knows his stuff too. Yeah. Doing great. I mean, you know, uh, you have to diversify. I have to, you know, I'm. I want this to be a community effort. And since I started this, uh, I used to own my own company. We had it was just me. I did all the banking, I did all the development, I did everything myself. And now it's, I want everybody. I even call my customers and say, hey, what do you think about our website? What do you think about your home? What, what, you know, is there any, any things that I can change? And I want everybody's input, you know? And uh, so that's where we're at. It's kind of, it's neat. It's a good feeling. Um, the stress is just minimal, you know, um, compared to what I used to do. Right. Um, running everything, doing the banking, doing the debt. to fly. I, I know when I come over and visit with you on the days that we didn't have work, you know, and help out on the job site, you just 100 mile an hour. Yeah. I, up, and it's nice to see its traction around. Yeah, I mean, it's good and, and it's fun and it's getting, 
everybody a part of it. It's this whole thing about tiny house, and that's why my philosophy is keeping the prices low, is that it's about being out of debt. It's about living free. And to live free, how can I build you a sixty, seventy thousand dollar home and you can't afford it? You know, you don't have to get a loan, now you got big payments, and you're still not free. And so my thing is if I build faster, I build more efficient, I can sell them cheaper, I can still make a living, but give you a great product. To me, in the law of finance and economics, that's a win-win, you know? So what we try to do is apply that law in the company. Um, we'll see. We've only been in this thing, what, eight, nine months? So um, 2016 is going to be a turning year to see what we're going to do. Yeah. And this is our new product here to show you for sure. Yeah, guys, we're, we're going to show you this in an additional video right now. We'll let Randy take you a tour through his new facility and tell you a little bit about the other things he's got going on. So let's take a look at it now. Hey, welcome to Incredible Tiny Homes. Uh, this is our home, and this is our new warehouse. Uh, we've had a few pictures of it on Facebook. Um, this used to be all glass, and we tore this out, built a 16 foot door so we could get our homes in and out. Our ceilings are close to 25, 30 feet tall. As you can see, um, this factory was built back in the 40s. Um, it is a beautiful factory. This concrete ceiling and just about everything we need. And I love it here. As you can see, we got all our, not all, this is just a fraction of the materials. We just brought this in. Um, I actually, you know, I've got a forklift that I can bring things in instead of pumping them off a truck. And, but I've been really fortunate with people helping me and actually Give him a truck to work with. Give me a, a flatbed truck to, to transport our materials. And uh, I don't know, it's just been a really unique, it's like almost a community project that I've got that people will find out what I'm doing and they want to help, you know? I buy materials and guys, ah, just use my truck. If you want to use my truck, go ahead. And you know, and, and I, I give that back to them. I give that back and I'll clean their lot up for them or, or I'll um, try to get them business. And, we build a rapport. So every person or every vendor that I'm with now, it's a, it's a rapport now. It's a friendship. It's building a relationship. And, and I'm finding that with all the customers that I, that I work for. Um, we, by the time we get through building, the process of them calling me or emailing me, we go through their blueprints. And I write your blueprint out. I figure it out and I draw it up. And boom, we come to a house. And by the end of that whole process, I become to know you. I know who you are. You know me. And it works out really well. So it's a, a real different and it's real personal, you know. Um, this right here, this is a home that we built, and it's all out of styrofoam. It's a fiberglass with a resin poured on the outside. We take a hammer, and you can't even penetrate this. You beat it and beat it, and it's just super strong. Hey, okay. this stuff is so awesome. You can take a hammer right here. Isn't that awesome? I mean, this is fiberglass uh, with phenolic fiber poured on it and we lamb I mean we have rustling matches on this thing. I mean it's just, it's just awesome. What a product. Okay. So that's maybe our future at uh, incredible tiny homes. Nobody in the industry is doing this stuff so hey how you like that? I mean a hailstorm. I mean a hurricane. Yeah look fast look at it. Huff. nails. Um, the foam is super efficient when it comes to, you know, I have a lot of guys out here, a lot of the tech guys be watching this if you do. I'm not a tech guy, you know. I'm an everything guy. I'm a builder, carpenter, snowboarder. I'm just everything, you name it, dad, whatever. But um, this is awesome. And I researched that you can get this product, but we love this. Um, there's no wood in this product except for the outside trim. We dialed it up with a little bit of trim to give it some homey look. And... The floor is three and a half inches of foam. The walls are three and a half inches of foam. The roof is six inches of foam. It's like, it's like being inside of a, uh, um, a cooler at a, at a restaurant. Randy, I'm really excited for you, man. Your new shop is awesome. This brings back a lot of memories of dad being here. It's, oh, yeah. It's kind of wild, man. And I'm glad to see life being brought back into this place again, too. Yeah. Well, thanks for coming by. I really appreciate it. We're excited for sure. Oh, I am yeah. too. Now you got some. Uh, you're going to start doing maybe some off-grid stuff in house too, because oh, yeah. uh, with the solar air heaters, like I've seen recently on the YouTube guys, uh, that's potentially going to be started and installed on the houses. Yeah, yeah. The, the uh, they're off-grid. Probably 80% of the people that, that get a hold of me 
Uh, they want off-grid capabilities. And in, in off-grid, there's so many really cool things. I've talked to some people that are inventing things that they're getting older than me. And so, I, I, you know, we'll have an off-grid web on our website. We're going to have an off-grid page and information and try to help people understand what they want, what the costs are. And, of course, you know, you're a big part of that for us, and we appreciate you. So uh, it's obviously it's exciting that we can offer so much for half of what everybody else is, is you know, charging people. Right. And that's the, that's the great thing. I mean, when you got everybody happy, it's like a guy told me, you know what a good contract is? Is that I come away okay, you come away okay. Neither one of us are like perfect, but we come around good. So I'm making okay money, you're getting a really nice house. And that's the thing right. is that you're probably getting a better deal than I am because I'm building in a nice house. And you're getting a home like the high end stuff. But our thing is, and we're going to see if we can do it. It's like I said, it's the efficiency and the time that it takes for us to build a house. So. I think you got to, you know, uh, there's a lot of good, good quality, positive feedback coming in out there in the community. I know the people that you previously built homes for that we're now going out and they've decided to do some off-grid stuff. Everybody's happy with their mm -hmm. home. And, and that's the only thing you can want at the end of the day yeah, is, yeah. you know, good, good positive feedback. So. Exactly. Exactly. So it's been good, man. Thank you. Glad to visit. Yeah, come on back. We'll do it again. Guys, make sure to check out Randy at IncredibleTinyHomes.com. Link is in the video description below. And as always, until we see you again here at the channel, I hope you have a most blessed day in Yahushua and I.